Hey guys, it's me, Zinkberg. Welcome back to my Minecraft Let's Play series. Uh, we have loads to do, and I think that a lot of this video is going to be time lapses. Um, so the idea is I'm going to place down a lot of blocks today. I'm going. I need to clear some blocks, and I need to place a lot of blocks. I want to get most of the Elvish Palace done, uh, and I have an idea for what I need. That will mean a little bit of collecting, more than a little bit of collecting, and a little bit of clearing. So let's get straight into it, guys. Okay, well, that was a lot of work. <laughs> that was a, a lot of clearing. Um, clearing out half a mountain, well, not half a mountain, but a bit of a mountain and all this space and creating uh, creating false bottoms on things and creating new hills and all of that sort of thing. That all took a lot of time. Um, so we've, we've cleared all of this over here to where the squid farm went. That's, that's where all of that spot was and I just put dirt over the top and lit it up underneath so it wouldn't be spawnable um, as I said in last week's episode we're going to make some nice uh, gardens or park or something down here um, on the other side we'll just fly over here um, so we've done the same thing all this part here that was where the squid farm was we've just gone uh, dirt over the top of all of this you can see uh, if I go into free cam you can see underneath there so oh I didn't light all of it up well that's a problem for a future me uh, but again this will all be part of a park and, and things like that too I think the royal gardens will sort of take up you know most of this area down around here once we get that in I need diorite um, I know that there is a very little bit of it here, so we'll uh, we'll collect this up. I don't know how deep this goes. Um, and actually, I did bury a captain uh, from from a raid that was happening over here, so hopefully we won't encounter him. I don't think we will. Um, I would I would imagine he's well gone by now. But yeah, we'll um, we'll get going, get all of this up, and then I need. Oh, I, I need a lot. I'm, I'm going to need a lot. So I think we'll head back underneath the tower and get uh, get the rest of it under there where I've got a haste beacon and things like that to help. Um, so I will see you after I've got all that together and I've got it turned into polished diorite. Of course, there are a few other things I need as well. Uh, I am not at all happy about being in here. <laughs> I don't know. Does anyone like this place? Does anyone like it? I mean, I get it. It's not meant to be Pleasantville. It's meant to be horrible. But does anyone truly love the Nether? I 
I I am just in a constant state of nervousness. Uh, this is what I was talking about last week about about the problem with courts. And I know Christopher you, you mentioned that um, I can always set up trading or you know whatever. Like can always there's other ways to do it. Unfortunately, I haven't. So we're uh, we're on the old manual courts bid. I'm not going to bother you with uh, with hours of footage of me. I'm just terrified every step I take. And I know these guys just love walking in front of you when you're swinging a pickaxe. And then you've got half of the nether all down on you all at once. Um, so I'm not going to bore. I'm not going to bore you. I already have bored you with way too much of this. I'm just going to run around and collect a whole heap of quartz, and uh, I will be. I'll see you in the next. Wait, no. Oh, no. I mean, I know it's no big deal. Wait. No. Um. Yes. Oh, don't, don't. Don't. Why? Just go away. I'm not... I'm not bothering you. Just stay stay over there. I've got gold on. Don't. What am I meant to do when you come and stand right on me like that? This is... Oh, it's just the worst. Oh, okay. All right. You have it. You, whatever's over there, you have it now. I, I don't even want it anymore. Another one in there. And I bet you he's going to... I bet you... Look, he's been happy standing there for probably 16 years. He's been standing right in that spot. And he's gone, wait, there's quartz over here. This person has quartz in their bag. Therefore, must get in the way. Uh, I... Yes, I'm... I'm just going to continue this horribleness and, uh, I'll, yeah, I'll see you somewhere else. <laughs> you know, I was thinking, how cool would it be if I could get all the way up to uh, the top of the tower just using a court stack like this? And then I thought, why am I doing this? I just put it in my offhand. And my, <laughs> so, uh, it was a really good idea, though. Like, like if I hadn't got up there, I've just, I've run out of steam. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'll see, see you on the other side. Okay, I'm also going to need a ton of iron, and we have already gone through a lot of what was in the chest down there. So, um... Die faster! <laughs> Spawn, hurry up. <laughs> There's one... Okay, I'm going to just let this happen, naturally. <laughs> Because if I stand here, imagine that. If I just show like a 35-minute video of me <laughs> a time lapse of golems just dying in a corner. It'll be fine. I'll have the iron. That's that's fine. That's not a problem. Okay, one last place that I need to visit. And I'm not looking forward to doing this bit at all. Okay, so we're here at the end and we're here for end rods. And I hate this place more than I hate the nether. <laughs> um, I I found a new a, a new city. Look at how low down the um, the ship is. It, it's really low. Uh, but yes, we need end rods, so we're going to get end rods. There are shulkers everywhere. Oh, I just don't like it at all. I don't like it at all. Oh, there's one there. Okay. Uh, what, one? Like, I'm all right against one or two. It's even still. Um, but it's once you get in those, you know. Those huge, huge problems of masses of them. That, that's when it bugs me. And and most of where I go, I'm going to going to fly. I think. Uh, well, I'm going to fly whether I want to or not. It turns out. Uh, there is no fun in watching me do this. I am a chicken, and I'm not. Uh, 
I, I'm not going to sit here and film this or put you through this. So, yeah, we'll we'll see how we go. Fleabag, Fleabag, we had the most marvellous time. You should have been there. <laughs> it was horrible, mate. It was absolutely horrible. Uh, we did get uh, 23 diamonds, which was surprising. That was that was a lot. 44 iron ingots, one elytra, a whole lot of gear that we'll probably never need. Uh, 46 shulker shells and just over two and a half stacks of, of end rods, which is good. That's that's what we were there for. So, yeah, mate, that was, uh, that was exciting. I think that's everything we need. We can get on with the build. Okay, I am back. This guy here is bothering me a lot. Is it just the one? I feel like there's more than one. <laughs> He's been teleporting back and forth. I'm hoping he's not angry at me. Okay, so let's have a look and see where we're up to. And of course, I've got the shaders on because it always looks so much more impressive. As we head over this way, um, this is what we're faced with from the side um, or from the diagonal. Um, I, I really, um, I really surprise myself sometimes on what, what I can get done. Um, like, like walking <laughs> in this perspective, <laughs> which I always struggle with. Um, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry I'm a little bit speechless um, I haven't I haven't gone back and had a look and I um, it just looks so good it just looks so good um, okay so let's go into let's go what how do we what, I it, part of that thing of the not making it feel grindy for me is I, I'm just gonna do bits and pieces as I as I want to not as I feel I need to um, even the top part of this build was a little bit of a struggle for me I, I was sort of struggling by the time I'd placed down all of this I was starting to get a little bit um, you know sort of feeling it a bit it's a lot of blocks to place um, so that's that bit there we'll, we'll go over towards the back here the back 
is unplanned. I haven't got a plan for how this plays out yet. I had thought that that this uh, this whole build will sort of meld into the mountain a little bit. Um, and I don't know... I don't know quite how. I have a couple of ideas um, and and I'll, I'll work something out. But but at the moment, you know, this is the first building of the palace. This is the main building of the palace. And I think this is where the doing the castle in season one, the way I did, um, this is the this is where I th oh, this is where I think I went sort of wrong with that i'm sorry i'm i really haven't had a good look at it um from from any perspective i just sort of got all the blocks down and, and finished that wow um okay so let's go over a few things number one i'm still not certain that this front bit here might not do what these do here and sort of come forward a little bit but looking at it it looks good the this bit here elven sort of buildings and things from what i can see and i i haven't i don't really know the elven stuff well but the more i'm sort of learning about it it's got lots of sort of um intertwined tree blocks and things like that and that's that's really hard to do um obviously in minecraft because we have blocks not not beautiful little lacy bits of timber um, this is all this is all got dark glass uh, black glass around the around the front of it here so a lot of that's going to pop a little bit more once there's something behind it um, but that's the idea here is that these bits here are actually a little sort of a drift up and around and down like that sort of thing with a bit of a, um, a sort of a pattern there um, I'm glad it doesn't appear to have a face on it. <laughs> Always ruins um, ruins builds when they have faces. So let's just have a look at it. Um, it's probably best if I don't speak. So the bottom level here is fairly simple. A lot of glass. I want it to be fairly open on the inside and I want it to be very very transparent through um, and, and it will be very well lit so it's very light on the inside um, then heading up we've got things like a little railing here which is done with trapdoors we've got the end rods everywhere um, using them as the light sources just to give it that real white look um, I did want a nice dark stripe through this part here, which I thought cauldrons fitted the fitted the bill for, for what I've done there. Small little sort of archway sort of things here. Originally they were going to be glass, but I sort of decided that if you have glass and glass and glass and glass and glass all the way up, it gets a bit it gets a bit much. So having a having a area here where it's more solid. Um, this will probably be around here will probably be the level for the um, for the first floor hey boy that is a shame uh, okay so the original plan was for this area to line up with this oh that's why I know why it's all okay everything's okay don't panic everyone stop panicking stop uh <laughs> it's okay because this level is the is the floor level that's right that level is the floor level there and that lines up with this bit here phew um I thought I'd build it all one level down so the cauldrons being there then we've got this nice sort of middle bit here with the lights fit a different way so they're in the middle here um, it is spawn proof so that's good um, using the diorite walls and stairs to give different textures and different appearances the, the polished and the standard diorite together to give darker or lighter little bits 
Um, then as it steps up here, just giving, again, I wanted a dark stripe and I thought that the cauldrons fit that this sort of look. So having these things all being little pointy bits like this, I thought having little individual pointy bits looked really good. Then we step up onto this level up here. Um, the idea behind this was that there would be a another level up around here that will be more an open sort of area. Um, I don't think I'm I'm not going to encase any of this, so this will be open here. And then of course the roof, um, just going with the iron blocks that go all the way up and over. Um, and down the other side, which I didn't do when I was building and I forgot all about it. So I had to go back and do those again. Oh, look, a pretty rainbow over effing, 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 <laughs> effing Dale. Ah, oh dear. Um, yeah, and I did, I did like the way that it sort of blends in with the, with the, um, with the mountainside here. But obviously this bit here can't stay that way. Right, so that, that's going to have to change um, this bit here. It won't be able to stay that way. And I may very well sort of make this into like a cave that goes back or something like that. Um, I, I think in my head, elven villages and elven cities and Elvis, El, Elvis, Elvis, <laughs> um, <laughs> elven cities tend to have a lot of organic matter in them. They tend to be very um, very plant-based, very tree-based. They're, they're lovers of the nature and draw on the nature and things like that. So so that will be the goal, will be to, to get enough of that nature into the, um, into the build. Just looks amazing. Uh, I did get a mod that is meant to allow much longer distances for um, for viewing. Ah, I have turned down my, my distance. Hang on a second. And if you hear the sound of whirring motors, that is my computer screaming as I try and load close to 60 chunks at once. Um, <laughs> so there's that there. If I spin around and go that way, I am hoping that... Come on. Oh, did we lose it? Yes, we did. We'll try doing this very slowly. I just crashed my computer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we don't make any sudden movements. But, uh, but that's great. Being able to see the tower from, from over here. And then, wait, I'm going to have to... <laughs> Ah, and then come back around and see that is really good. I'm not going to leave that setting on because I'm going to destroy and it burn something down. In a minute. <laughs> that is that is that, guys. That's um, sorry for all the time lapses and things. Well, I hope there are time lapses. I mean, I I presume there are time lapses. Uh, it's not as talky an episode as normal. And uh, yeah, we have um, <clears throat> we have lots of things to do over the next week or so. Uh, trying to get out a Craftworks episode somewhere in the middle of the week, but that may not happen at this point. We'll see how we go, depending on the weekend. Um, if not, we have tons to do over there. So uh, yeah, um, thank you very much for joining me, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope you enjoyed the, what I'm doing with that build over there. Um, large diagonal builds really interesting really uh really taking a lot of me to to be able to think that way um love you all to death thank you so much for all your support i really appreciate every single one of you uh, have a great week guys i'll speak to you later bye